And this is Sean's View Entertainment right here on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to give you the full show review and results of the Beast in the East that was just on the WWE Network, a historic event from Tokyo, Japan. And I felt this show was definitely worth a watch from the beginning till the end. There was uh, matches, there was highlights, and there was moments in these matches the first match, Neville versus Chris Jericho, an extraordinary outing. Um, this match had everything a pure wrestling match should have. Chris Jericho comes away with the victory in one of the matches of the night, 4.5 out of 5 stars. And this was a great way to get the, the crowd uh, definitely in tune to what was going to happen. It set the tone for the rest of the night. And these Tokyo Japan fans were definitely on their feet and they were excited. They were in excitement of what we're, they were about to witness and what transpired in front of their very eyes when the NXT title was on the line as Kevin Owens went against the challenger, Finn Balor, and yet another match of the night, five out of five stars. Hell, this could have been, uh, you know, match of the year, uh, one of the candidates to be match of the year. And we come away with a new NXT champion, Finn Balor, over Kevin Owens. And then we had a very big tag team match it was John Cena and Dolph Ziggler versus Kane and King Barrett this was a long and exhausting entertaining match but in the end John Cena and Dolph Ziggler would come away with the victory in a match I would say was 3.5 out of 5 stars nothing stellar but it was still a fun tag team match in my estimation uh, we've seen Brock Lesnar apps gave it his best shot. He tried to throw his best hits. But in the end, Brock Lesnar would prevail over Kofi Kingston. The New Day would come in. They would try to provide a distraction. They would try to take down Brock Lesnar. The numbers game did not impact Brock Lesnar. But instead, Brock Lesnar impacted the New Day by destroying them with F5s. Not one, not two, but three. So the Beast in the East definitely seeked out and destroyed the New Day tonight. And Kofi Kingston got defeated with the f and then we would see Nikki Bella defend her WWE Divas Championship as she would defeat Tamina and Paige and what was another decent match definitely like I said this this was an event you know waking up at 5 o'clock in the morning for this event staying up till 8 o'clock uh, you know it, it was definitely a little bit tough it was a little hard but that goes to show you the dedication my motivation my enthusiasm and everything that I bring to my channel here on Sean Entertainment for the subscribers with the subscribers so to, so to rate this event, the top two matches, obviously Neville Jericho and Kevin Owens versus Finn Balor. The tag team match was fun. Uh, the Divas match was okay. Uh, you know, and, um, you know, th this this event was what it was. And it's definitely worth a watch when you have time. I suggest to go check it out. I'll rate it out of five stars, the whole event, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll give it four out of five stars. Once again, it's worth a watch. It's worth your time. Your comments, your opinions. What was your favorite match? Uh, what was your exciting moments? Were you surprised that Kevin Owens lost the NXT title? What about the tag team match? And what about Neville versus Jericho? And what about Brock Lesnar de destroying the New Day? Subscribe. How's that for some positive?